Hello, this is Brian Laufer, Vice President of Operations at Aspire Technologies, the developers of QuoteWorks sales quoting software. This video will demonstrate how easy it is to link to ConnectWise as a product source. This functionality is available in Build 4 and Higher in the Corporate Edition of QuoteWorks. Before this integration, many ConnectWise users linked to the ConnectWise SQL tables, which worked, but inactive items would be returned in the search results. This also was not available to those that were on the hosted ConnectWise model either. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the basic setup. It's quite simple. All I'm going to do is go to the Contacts menu and set up Contact Manager. Obviously, I'm going to have ConnectWise selected as my Contact Manager. And um, I'm going to assume that we've already filled out uh, the URL and login details. So I'm going to click on ConnectWise Setup. And I'm going to go to the Product Data Source tab across the top. And what I need to do now is just simply map the ConnectWise product types to QuoteWorks item types. So I'll go ahead and map these over. And uh, this drop down here is actually being pre filled based on the item types that I already have in QuoteWorks. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave miscellaneous blank just for this example. And what's going to happen is for any ConnectWise product types that are not mapped, they're going to use this default item type. And in this case, I'm going to go ahead and use product. Okay. And I'm going to click on OK. And now I can go ahead and add ConnectWise as a product source. To do that, we just go to the products menu and set up product sources. And you can see right now I just have one product source. I'll go ahead and click on new now. And in the drop down list, I'm going to say see ConnectWise. Click on that. Click on Next. Um, we've already defaulted the fields for you, but you can map uh, additional fields to uh, QuoteWorks fields. I'm going to go ahead and click on Next. And we, uh, we can give this product source a name. I'm going to leave it as ConnectWise. Click on Next. If we want to change the column titles um, inside of QuoteWorks, we can do that. I'm, again, in this example, I'm just going to leave them as the defaults. Click on Next. If you don't have that many products, you can uh, check the checkbox to show all products or services when the product source is selected. It's up to you. Um, for right now, I'm not going to do that. Um, the other things you can do too is you can use, uh, you can create custom menus in the product lookup as well. Um, again, this is just going through a quick overview, so I'm not going to go through that setup. I'm going to click on Finish, click on Close. Now I can click on Products, and you'll notice that I now have a ConnectWise product source. So I can click on Show All, which is going to log into Connect and find all of my products. And as you can see, it returned 255 items, which really didn't take that long. And uh, you can see we've got the different item types down the side here. If I sort it, you can see a little bit better here. Uh, most of these are products, but I do have some services in there. Looks like all I have are products and services. Uh, but what I can do is I can do a search now. So maybe I want a router. So I can click on Find. And as you can see, it returned 12 routers. Um, and to use the items in ConnectWise is, uh, from the ConnectWise product source is just like using any other product from a product source within QuoteWorks. So if I wanted to, um, I could select this product here, double click on it, append it, click on close, and you'll notice that I have the item in my quote. Um, so that's really it. Um, using ConnectWise as a product source is quite simple. And what's nice is the fact that inactive items will not show up in the search result, uh, which is a big improvement over linking directly to the SQL tables. Okay, so I'd like to thank you for watching this quick QuoteWorks demonstration. If you have any questions about this functionality or anything else about QuoteWorks, please feel free to give us a call or send us an email.